have to hand it to the director. He does have style. Well, he is the big boss of an evil organization. He almost have to. Evil organization, huh? <sighs> Somebody seems awfully out of it right now. <sighs> that damn bureau is nothing but a waste of government money. We're all you need to keep Akihabara safe, damn it. Where's Saki? She went home. Yep, she's gone. Mizuki and Aoi saw her off at the station. Saki Saki didn't even remember my name. Man. I think that's enough fraternizing for one day. Time you guys and us guys parted ways. But... It's okay, Asahi. Calm down. Go. It'll all be fine. Just calm down. Well, this is a rarity. If you'll be excusing us then. Mm, before I go, though, I gotta thank you for granting Saki's wish. We owe you there. Bye-bye! <laughs> I heard about Saki. She didn't even remember me. She awoke from her dream. After all this time, there's still so much we don't know. But you do. What are delusions, really? <laughs> Just freaking tell us already, you old git! You were in the DAB yourself, weren't you? You gotta know! <sighs> Guess there's no sense hiding it anymore. Yeah. I was indeed part of the Bureau, up until three years ago, anyway. At that time, I was in charge of making a visualization device for the delusions. Visualization device? There's something to allow the general public to recognize delusions as delusions. Just couldn't quite get it right, though. Back then, the only delusion that had a hold on me was the delusion called work. I devoted myself to it every day. So, what changed? Why'd you give it up? Simple. I got fed up with it. That's all there is to it. Huh? Once you kids enter the workforce, you'll understand. There are times we adults just can't take it anymore. So, you got a handle on who I really am now, or what? No, because I don't think you're telling us the whole truth. Mari Tojo was the person you were looking for, right? And you found her. So why are you still with us? I'm not looking for her so much as I'm looking for an answer. And that, I haven't found yet. Still don't get it. One day you will, but for now, that's all the info you're getting out of me. And after all, I'm doing all the talking here. There's one among our number who hasn't said a word. <laughs> you seem pretty heartbroken, kid. It is true that we destroyed that girl's delusion, but if we hadn't, the Bureau would have. One way or another, the end result would have turned out the same. But I'm the one who pulled the trigger, which means Saki's memories are gone because of me. And that has to be pretty disquieting, I get it. You're in shock from collapsing the delusion. But it didn't seem like she forgot completely. I'm betting in time she might start to remember. Do you think she really can? With the right spark? Yeah. I think it could happen. But who's to say the things she'd remember would be happy? Now that her delusion's gone, I wouldn't put money on it. Are you stupid? Cole? She said she believed in you, right? Gave you permission to destroy her delusion? Yeah, but... She sacrificed her own delusion to keep the world safe, didn't she? But the delusion contractor is still around. As long as that's the case, delusions will continue to spread. Then Hoshino's dream was all for nothing? God, I can't even bear to look at you anymore. Asahi, come with me for a sec. Huh? Where? The castle delusion. Come on!
care to share a cuppa with a maid or seven? Come on down and be a maid man. Here's a flyer with more information. Man, it's got to be a pain handing those out every single day. Comes with the territory. Every job's got its pain in the ass duties. You want to work, you got to deal with them. Yeah, yeah, I know. Do you just not want a job or what? And that's enough of this conversation. You gotta face reality sooner or later. How old did you say you were again? Nineteen. Around the same age I was when I started thinking about work. Not too late to get something good if you start now. Never took you for a planner. I always figured you were just winging it 24-7. Everybody's gotta walk that road sometime. I'll take the shortcut, thanks. You think this is some kind of joke, kid? Alright, here's one for you. We're gonna find you a job right now. Uh, what? A job, an occupation, a career, whatever you want to call it. I believe there's been a breakdown in communication here. Yeah, because I'm not getting through to you. I'll make it clear. Get. A. Job. I'm not cut out for the workforce. Maybe not, but you gotta join it sooner or later anyway. You planning to just keep living like you are now? Well, no, but... Take it from someone with more life experience. Just looking for work can be a lot of fun if you let it. Let you really consider your future. And I ain't asking you to accept a job on the spot or anything. Just to look. Man, you're really serious. Damn straight. Now, let's go see what's available. You're the perfect age for a little job hunting. It'll be a blast. Bank and new Road to Dragoons merch in stock. Be sure to check it out. It's limited run, so supplies are uh, <clears throat> limited. <laughs> so get it while the getting's gettable. Think you could work a shop like this? I mean, yeah, it's definitely in line with my interests, but I don't know. What don't you know? Well, they say you shouldn't make your hobby your work, right? Eh, that's a fair point. It is? Doing something you enjoy for work can kind of rob you of your enjoyment if you're not careful. You do know I wasn't being serious, right? I gather as much, but that doesn't mean you aren't right. Anyway, let's go check out some other job opportunities. working in a bustling place like this. It does seem like it'd be fun, but remembering what's what and where seems like an impossible task for this brain. Pretty sure it happened naturally while you work, and probably a lot quicker than you think. Yeah, you might be right. I feel, though, like being a customer is the real draw of a place like this. It would lose its allure if I worked here. You're right. That sort of thing definitely does happen. Ragey? All just excuses, though, to you buck down and try it. Otherwise, you'll never know if the job is bliss or hell. Did you enjoy your...